So here's a continuation going into the excerpt of the hamstring stretch. Now you're lying down on your back, we'll call it neutral spine, so do not tuck your pelvis. Your leg, your thigh, your leg, and your feet parallel to each other. I call it it's a number 11 from the side, your leg, and your feet. And from here, you will start, we're going to do a movement called a single leg happy baby. And so I grab for the right leg, my elbows outside the knee, scapula stabilize and bring that knee toward outside the ribcage toward the floor. So we open up, waking up the hip socket and give an inner thigh a nice stretch warming up. Cross your right leg over the left. We're preparing a rotation from the hip. So use the right side internal obliques, rotate the pelvis, keep the right shoulders down so you create that opposition for stretch, so a nice beautiful spiral. And use your breath to deepen in the stretch, slowly roll right back with the dummy. Switch side, of course. On the exhale, you start. Each exhale, you can increase the stretch and make sure the opposite shoulder stays scapula, stay on the floor. You should abdominal again, roll your pelvis back, so don't swing your leg, uh, you should need to swing back. And start with, this is the proximal portion gastro stretch, keep both elbows down. Now this though hamstring, as I say, I'm doing much faster than what you should be, I'm just doing demonstration. Now press, now there's a whole hamstring stretch, leg has to be straight, that's why you start the distal first, which behind the knee, proximal pushing hamstring connect to your sit bone. So if you pass 90 degree, like I just did, I will extend the other leg to help my pelvis stay neutral. So I can really target the hamstring truth, truthfully. And exhale is the stretch. And you stay there for extra three breaths to get the fascia opened up. Here comes the trick. If you medial rotate from the hip socket, you are stretching the medial hamstring. So there are three groups of hamstring. You have the medial one, so sami tendon, sami member noses. So you medial rotate, you can grab hold the rope stretch and extra three breaths again and get the fascia. Now you're wrapping outside the, only the ankle, hold with the same side arm. Opposite arm, bring the right knee to the left shoulder. We're targeting the bicep femoris. Femoris, that's for femur. So there's a bicep on the femur. So that's lateral hamstring, the much tighter one. Of course, you will do more than this. I'm just demonstrating. Keep your child heel. Now cross the lower leg. I start working on the IT band. That's the iliotibial band on the side of the leg. They're very long. So there's a three parts. And we just showed the first part, 45. Now it's 90 degree cross to the opposite hip. Do not rotate your pelvis. So again, that stabilization happens. And exhale, now a little higher, you can see my knee to the opposite rib cage. So that IT band goes all the way to the ilium, which is the round hip bone. Now we're getting the whole line of the IT band on this extra stretch with the breath. And you can switch side. And I will show you the very last one. I'll show you this way because it's harder to see with the camera. So the last movement of all the hamstring stretch is the inner thigh. So I switch leg to just to demonstrate. You can see the inner thigh, my lower legs, AB dog away from the midline. And I medial rotate after 90 degree, degree, the hip socket naturally lightly rotate. Don't worry. If you take a workshop, I will show you exactly. We always do a little bit of hip release to recover all that. 